Alright guys, even here and Hadi Chopin just got into the United States. He got his visa, he will be at the Mr. Olympia. Exciting news, right? This is really, really good news for bodybuilding, especially after that sad event today. Bodybuilding legend dying in a tragic accident, Franco Colombo. But now we got some really good news for bodybuilding and for Mr. Olympia. And Hadi Chopin is competing, he is doing Mr. Olympia. So, Harry Chopin posted this photo of himself and his coach, Honey Rambot, at the airport. You can see sign says, Welcome to San Francisco. So, it is obvious that he is in the America, but the description of it was in Arabic, so I don't speak it, although I translated it, and as you can see, it doesn't really make a lot of sense, the whole translation, it's uh, Google Translate, but the most important part you can read, you can see. So basically he says, I arrived in America today and then later his coach, Honey Rambut himself, posted a photo as well, the same photo with a following caption. You can read the whole thing if you want, but the most important part is here in yellow. Uh, he said, they said it couldn't be done. Harry Chopin, the Persian wolf, has just landed in the USA to prepare for the Mr. Olympia and he's hungry. So it is official, it is official, Harry Chopin will be at the Mr. Olympia, he got his visa, that's right, everybody thought that he was denied, there was that rumor that circled around, many YouTube channels made a video about it and they weren't sure, but they were talking about it and at one point everybody pretty much signed him off. While this whole thing was happening, I made a video about Harry Chopin denying the fact that he was denied visa. And uh, it's true, I mean, the man said it himself, he said, I was not denied, it's all rumors. But people decided to use that rumor to make videos instead of listening to Hadi himself. Anyways, now it is official, he actually got that visa. So that was all false and we're gonna see him at the Mr. Olympia. The question, the biggest question is, is he gonna do open or 212? Well, I have no idea, but in my opinion, I think he will do open because he is qualified for the open. And how will he do in the Open? I think he has the potential to be uh, fourth place. I don't really see him placing higher than that because the other guys are just too big for him. Bonek, Brandon and Rolly are just uh, much bigger than him because they are taller. Hari is very, very short. But he has that uh, graininess, that conditioning, that fullness. That he peaks perfectly. I mean, look at him here. This is just outstanding. So I don't think Dexter will be able to beat him. I think he will be uh, better than Dexter, also better than Cedric. I think fourth place is the worst case scenario for Harry Chopin. I will probably make another top six prediction video for the Mr. Olympia. That top six will be made of, not in particular order, Harry Chopin, Dexter Jackson, Cedric McMillan, Brandon Curry, William Bonac and Rolly Winkler. And I think Harry Chopin will be at least fourth place in the Open or even above that. If Rolly comes off, if Bona comes off, he can beat them, but that's probably not gonna happen. So I think fourth place for him is probably the best and the worst case scenario. I think he will beat uh, Cedric and Dexter rather easily. Although if he competes in 212, if he decides to do that, he will win the Mr. Olympia easily. Nobody else can challenge him, not Derek Lansford. I think this guy is much better than Derek, but I don't think he will downsize for 212. He is too big for the 212 now. He got to 225 for uh, Vancouver Pro where he won the show. I think he should compete in the Open, I think that's his division right now, he's big enough, he can challenge the other guys, he can crack the top 3, maybe, you know, if somebody comes a little bit off. So that's about it for this video guys, thank you very much for watching, tell me if you are excited about this thing and tell me do you think Kari will do 212 or the Open and how will he do if he does either of those two divisions. Once again guys, thank you very much for watching, if you enjoyed the video make sure to like it and if you want to see more, subscribe. All the best guys, bye bye.